The core argument I've presented in Women in the Studio is that the development of music production skills by female artists is significant because of their minority status in the broader field of music production and because of the historic gendering of the creativity, technical skills and control associated with the practice. The argument is held when I sought out the roots of the gendering that has taken place in music production and located them in constructions surrounding social class and race, which, in addition to gender, form the three divisive pillars in contemporary society, which continue to underpin the cultural frameworks that either validate or discredit acts of creativity and their subsequent products. Furthermore, the argument has gained momentum.